Are you an off-island resident and thinking about buying property here in Prince Edward Island? Specifically large parcels of land or something that has excess water frontage? Be warned of the Island Regulatory Appeals Commission or IRAC. The way it works is this. IRAC, in theory, sets up the prices for milk, heating oil, gasoline, they control rental properties, uh, landlord tenants, basically everything on the island that's regulated in that sense. The other thing they regulate is purchases of property, specifically properties with more than five acres or 165 feet of water frontage. If you are electing to buy a property that has more than 165 feet of water frontage or five acres of land, regardless of whether it's house or just raw land, you will have to go through Island Regulatory Appeals Commission. Now there is a bit of a trick. Number one, there's a multipli multiplication factor. And what that is, is if you had say a wife and a husband, you can multiply that 165 feet and five acres by two, so 320 and 10, and so on for three or four, five, six, seven, eight. I've had as many as eight or nine people on one deed to get around the IRAC regulations. So what's involved? What's involved in an IRAC application is basically three things. Number one, they want a 1% fee for the application, 1% of the purchase price. So if it's a $100,000 property, it's a $1,000 application fee. Number two, they want to make sure that the, app, the um, property has been advertised typically on MLS for more than 90 days. So they are going to ask for a letter from the listing agent to make sure that property has had sufficient time for the locals to have a shot at it. And number three, in my opinion, you want to hire a lawyer that does a lot of real estate transactions or IRAC applications. In my opinion, IRAC is not a concern. I have about a 99.9% .9 success rate uh, done right. It's basically a time delay. If you're thinking of closing in a week or two, chances are it's not going to happen. Typically when IRAC is involved, since they meet only once a month, you may have to delay your closing by 30 to 40 to 65 days. I'm Michael Posnick with Century 21 Northumberland. Thank you for watching and have a great day.